Go. We are all in this together. Never before as a global community have we experienced something that has impacted all of us at the same time, and we're all responding to it at the same moment. Across the world, no matter what language you speak, we all feel the same feeling of, of, of loneliness, desire to be close to those that we love, to be to again together with our family and our community. It's in this week's Tubal Torah portion, Parshot Tazriya Mitzora, that the Torah describes a skin disease, Sa'arat, that require those afflicted with Sa'arat to go into isolation, to leave the camp, and to enter into quarantine. It's not in this week's Torah portion, but rather in the Book of Numbers, in the next book of the Torah, that Miriam, Moses' sister, is afflicted with Sa'arat. Moses offers a short one-line prayer, El na Rafanala, please God, heal her. The Torah says Miriam was shut out of the camp for seven days, and that the people did not march on until Miriam was readmitted. There's a Midrash, a rabbinic interpretation that adds that not only did the people of Israel wait, but also God also waited with the Israelites for Miriam to re-enter the camp. God did not continue moving forward with, that, with Miriam left behind. This Midrash reminds us that we are in this together. We continue to wait, and that act of waiting demonstrates that no one is alone. We wait and the day will come when we'll all be able to be present together physically with one another. And then, only then, can we begin to move forward together. Shabbat Shalom.